The province of South Kivu, located in the east of Democratic Republic of Congo, officially launched a vaccination campaign on Sunday aimed at stopping the spread of the Mpox virus. With over 8,843 cases already reported, including 45 deaths, South Kivu is now considered the epicenter of the virus in the DRC and Africa. When I see how my child suffers with all these sores she has and the pain that comes from it, I feel very bad about it. That's why I chose to get vaccinated. Mpox is a contagious and dangerous disease that affects more than 70% of children aged between 1 to 17. The provincial health minister indicated that now over 47,911 people are expected to be vaccinated. The most vulnerable population includes frontline health workers, contacts, and the general population, as well as echo guards, that totals to a target of over 47,911 people who we expect to vaccinate. The vaccination of children will follow afterwards. Many parents who came to vaccinate their children were surprised to learn that only adults would be vaccinated. The situation has heightened distrust among the population. Why are they bringing vaccines only for adults and not for children? They should give the vaccines to the children. If it's only for adults, we will refuse these vaccines and leave the situation as it is. Thank you. On the ground, to dispel distrust within the community, several local organizations are raising awareness about the importance of vaccination. The health zone of Miti Moresa is the epicenter of the epidemic. This is where there are the most cases, sick individuals, contacts, and people exposed to mpox. Vaccination strengthens collective immunity. This means we want to break the chain of transmission with people already exposed but immunized. It will help us weaken or interrupt that chain. The initiative for the vaccination campaign against Mpox comes at a time when DRC is recording the highest number of cases in the world, with over 30,000 infected and with nearly 990 deaths since the beginning of the year.